This is Ellen K, the VHS guy, and it's time for a VHS update for January 7th, 2017. Let's not waste any time, so let's get started. This is a Bel Canto tape from Paramount. And the other three I have are Inbell and Mascara, Ingmar Bergman's Magic Flute, and La Bohemi. This is originally a 1986 VHS, but this is a mid 1990s reprint because of the seal sticker. Could possibly be a reprint from the early 1990s. Here's an RC Columbia Pictures flat box tape. And this is one of the last ones in that design. But I still collect these nonetheless. Right side is unfortunately ripped off. Something underneath the sticker label, so that might be widescreen of death. 14th week of 1988. This is a pretty uncommon tape right here, so I just had to get it. Got most of these at a thrift store today. A bunch of the ones I got at another place. Print date is December 3rd, 1994. I do have Rambo First Blood Part 2 as well, but I don't have the first one. This has a print down here, December 9th, 1989. So put on the 50th week of 1989. So this obviously means it'll have the widescreen of death at the end. So they call me a TriStar tape from 1996. Former owner from Blockbuster purchased on August 20th, 1997. Print, the, print on the 6th week of 1997. This is an MGM tape. And this is a former rental, as you can see. July 8th, 1998. It has a cool MGM UA seal sticker on it. Never seen that on, on an MGM tape before. And the next two are Warner Home Video Cheese Show tapes. This one's from the Adult Action category. I do collect a lot of these Cheese Show tapes. And this is a Canon film. If there's any end label on a Warner Brothers tape, I'm not going to peel those off. I'm going to keep those intact. So I think, because I think that's the best way to keep it. To keep it, preser to preserve it that way. This is a former rental. June 9th, 1993, and June 10th, 1993. The next one is another MGM UA title, this time from 1992. Former from Video Visions. September 4th, 1992. I thought what this this looked like a pretty interesting tape, so I just thought, thought I would just get it. Get this. Unfortunately the box is in pretty terrible condition.
This is my second This Is America Charlie Brown tape I have. The other one is Vanessa Space Station. And this is Volume 6. This is originally a 1995 VHS, but 2003 reprint. 32nd week of 2003. And I do enjoy the Peanuts special, so I just had to get it. Former Run from Hollywood video. Got quite a lot of former rental tapes lately. And I try to look for those. Because they have the original previews at the beginning. Twelfth week of 1999. This is definitely a classic movie. I've seen A Night of the Opera quite recently, and it was really funny. Uses 1984 tape labels, although this is a 1986 VHS. This is a Kuroko home videotape. And another Jacques Claude Van Damme film, just like Bloodsport. Forty fourth week of nineteen ninety two, and this is another former rental. This is my second Bruce Lee the Master Collection tape I have. The other one is Fist of Fury. It has a CBS Fox video logo in the box. I I have to check if it still has it at the beginning. Printed on the 6th week of 2000. So I believe this will have the CBS Fox logo. MCA Home Videotape, just like Animal Crackers. Print date is the 7th week of 1989. And the next two are demo tapes. And this is a double feature demo tape from 1997. It's two films which are Contagious and Bloodhounds 2. It's a really cool find right here. Twenty first week of nineteen ninety seven and it's an EP mode, so this will obviously have a white screen of death at the end of the tape. This is another one I picked up today. Pause the video if you want to read the information on here. Print date is March twenty eighth, nineteen ninety nine. And I know the box is not in the best condition. This is a PBS home videotape distributed by Pacific Arts Video. Family Classic. Despite having the cheese shield label on the box, logo on the box, this is a boring shield reprint. October 5th, 2001. And most of the tapes I got at a thrift store, now we get to the tapes I got at the Salvation Army today. This is an MGM UA Home Video title. It's still sealed. And this is from 1995. Move those back so I can have more room. Here's another demo tape. I know Fisher Rachel has this one as well. Pause the video if you want to read the information on here. 
March 28th, 2000. Print date is the 33rd week of 1991. This is a Honeymooners tape, volume 11 out of 20. White screen death printings. Print date is the 40, 40th week of 1993. And this is an MGM Musicals tape, new remastered edition. And the next few are D Disney Spanish tapes. So here we go. Snow White and the Seven Dwarves. Print day is February 24th, 1995. Pinocchio. April 9th, 1995. I do have the 1985 and 1993 Walt Disney Classics Prince of Us films. Mickey and the Beanstalk, part of a favorite stories collection. It's also have the mini classics print as well from 1987. March 14, 1995. The Aristocats. Masterpiece collection tape. May 24th, 1996. Here's the last Disney Spanish tape, The Prince and the Pauper, another favorite stories tape. May 27th, 1994. Definitely the best find to have found at the Salvation Army today. And here's a uh, Buena Vista widescreen collector series tape. Finally we got another one. I do have a full screen print as well. Still in the shrink wrap, which is cool. June 10th, 1999. Here's a Royal and Hardy tape from 1991 from Video Treasures. Royal and Hardy and the Family. Forty-six week of 1997, so this is a reprint. And here's the last tape I got today, and this is another cheese show tape. Another canon film from the adult action category once again. Same thing with Blood Sport. Formula from Showcase Video. And that is going to be it for my VHS update. And I'll see you later.